Hi, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to use Google to spin your articles for free, no cost, no tricks attached. So the website we're going to be using is called translate.google.com. This is the website here, translate.google.com. You log on to this website and then we have two blank pages here, right inside here, two blank box, rectangular boxes rather. Is where you get to paste the article you want to print, you want to spin, and then at this other box here, you know, there's a box right here. When you get to paste the article, you get to see another box appear right here, and the spin articles will appear right here. So, just to for so in order to proceed, we're going to translate an article right now so um, we're going to translate this article we're going to translate this article we're going to try and spin it using Google so we copy it and then you come in here you paste it right here as you can see it, autom it automatically translates to Spanish you could translate to whatever language Arabic you know whatever language you want to want to translate it to so let's say we translate it to Spanish. So the next thing that we have to do is um you copy the translated article that is in Spanish, you copy it, right click and copy, and you paste it in a blank office processor. Can you see? See? It's in Spanish. So we go back, we copy it again. So what we do now, what we need to do is to we copy, is to copy the the spinned articles, article rather, the translated article. So what we so what we need to do, what we need to do right now is to copy the translated article. We need to copy it, right click, copy, and then we also highlight. The original article as in English, we highlight it and then we paste this particular article that has been copied here, the Spanish article that, that we just copied. We paste it here, and as you can see, it's translated to Arabic, but we want it in English, so we have to click on English. Can you see now the article that was translated to Spanish? That we copied here has then been has been retranslated to English language. So what we need to do now is copy a new article. We copy it and then paste it. We paste it in a in a new office processor, what processor rather? And as you can see here, this is a different article. From the original one, if you get to compare it, you get to see a lot of changes right there. You get to see a lot of changes right there. This is the original article that was being translated. If you can read it, go through and read it, you get to see that there have been some changes right there. Okay, let's get to see. It says here, business to business firms are those firms that sell products and services among themselves. Let's get to see this one, the, the new article, let's see what it says at the top. It says business to business firms are those that So now we get to compare, we need to compare the two articles and see the differences. 
this is the original article that we translated and this is the new article the new translated article that we just got so we need to compare the two articles and see it says here business to business firms are those firms that sell products and services among themselves business to business firms are those that sell article that sell products and services among themselves this is the same it says here the second sentence the selling is done to a client or sorry the selling is done to a client of other company it says here the sale is made to customer to a customer of another company and you see the differences the selling is done to a client of another company the sale is made to a customer in another company it says here who might use the product for intermediate purposes you could use the product for intermediate purposes or so can you see that the advertisements relating to b2b companies should not be, should not only generate interest the announcements see here it says advertisements it says adma the advancements here concerning b2b yeah it's relating to b2b so if you get to read the article you know from top to bottom you get to see that a couple of words have been changed and sentences have been changed which makes it unique and 100 percent new article for you to use for your website into article market marketing thank you